PSA's Three Mountain Task was developed to explore how children perceive different viewpoints, focusing on egocentrism during the pre-operational stage of cognitive development, ages 2 to 7. The task uses a model with three distinct mountains, each with unique features, a snow-capped peak, a house, and a tree. A child is asked to describe their own view of the model, then choose from photographs to represent how a doll, positioned at different points around the model, would see it. PSA's aim was to assess whether children could understand perspectives other than their own. In his findings, children younger than seven consistently failed the task. They chose photos that matched their own view rather than the doll's perspective, demonstrating what PSA called egocentrism, the inability to decenter from their viewpoint. As children mature into the concrete operational stage, ages 7 to 11, they develop the ability to take other perspectives and succeed in the task. This shift reflects the cognitive transition from egocentric thinking to the ability to mentally represent multiple viewpoints. The experiment is closely tied to PSA's theory of cognitive development, where children's thinking progresses through distinct stages, sensorimotor, pre-operational, concrete operational, and formal operational. Each stage represents increasingly sophisticated cognitive abilities. The Three Mountain Task targets children in the pre-operational stage, where their thinking is still limited by their immediate visual experiences. Criticism of the task suggests that it may be too abstract for younger children, who might not fully understand the setup rather than failing due to egocentrism alone. Alternative tasks using more relatable materials have shown that children can sometimes demonstrate an understanding of different perspectives at younger ages. These newer tasks, which involve more familiar objects, have yielded different results, suggesting that cognitive abilities may be underestimated in PSA's original design. Despite these critiques, the Three Mountain Task remains one of the first systematic attempts to measure how children develop perspective-taking skills. PSA's findings reinforced his view that children's cognition is qualitatively different from that of adults and develops gradually over time. In educational contexts, PSA's work has influenced how teachers approach learning, particularly with young children. The recognition that younger children struggle with perspective-taking has led to more concrete, hands-on learning activities in classrooms. These experiences are designed to match children's developmental stage, with abstract reasoning being introduced later. In conclusion, the Three Mountain Task highlights the importance of considering how children's thinking evolves, particularly their ability to recognize that others see the world differently. This understanding is crucial in social development, empathy, and educational practices that cater to different cognitive stages. If you learn something new about how psychology affects our daily lives, then consider subscribing to my YouTube channel so that you don't miss the next episode. Until next time, stay sharp.